because they said one plus one is equal to two. I don't know how we're on three. Is it one, one plus one is not three now. Eh? Why are we three in this thing? hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel my name is Trish Patrick. if you didn't know now you know so subscribe and in today's video mm -hmm, as you've seen from the title of this video i'm going to be giving you guys a story time how i became a side thing without knowing Yeah, um, I have to remove these glasses so I can get so I can get into the details. Yeah. So you guys, this happened when I was seventeen. Yeah, seventeen. I just finished secondary school. Okay, let me just say, let me just say, I was in year one then. Mm -hmm. So I met this guy and we were dating. You know, one of those relationships relationships where the holy ghost is telling you it's not gonna work my child leave this relationship leave this relationship but then no you are still there with your, with your coconut head you want to be there you say but i love him now this is like this was one of those kind of relationships so <laughs> we started the team yeah and then we we're always like quarreling about little little things all this kind of silly 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 things we even quarreled about Starabla one time. If you don't know what the Starabla is, I'm going to put it on the screen here so you can see. So, we even quarreled about Starabla at some point. It was just kind of useless, useless and meaningless quarrels. So, see, I don't want to talk too much. Let me just get into the T. The T. Yeah. So, <laughs> um, okay. Fast forward to when everything went down. I was seeing a picture of a girl on his phone, so I was always like, who is this babe? He'll, he'll be like, oh, um, that she was his best friend's um girlfriend. He will not become just to me about their relationship and stuff. That the, the relationship was nice. And everything. I, d I didn't say anything bad in it because you can be part of your friend's relationship. Okay, cool. It's not my business. So, women like me, I didn't know something was going down. Mm? <laughs> so um um let me see a month a month a month later something the girl came to the girl came to his side to his place and he didn't tell me that the girl was coming or something like that he didn't say anything to me only for me to get to his place and meet the girl so um they were on the bed watching television like they were sitting down watching television so um he knew i was coming the friend was there too like a friend was there too okay see here let's call this guy spinach no sorry let's call the girl spinach and call the boy pencil like my boyfriend sorry my ex let's call him pencil yes yeah, so one of his friends was there. Oh, like all the friend now. Oh, like all the friend. I'm not giving him a name. I'm not giving him a name. So his friend, Pencil's friend, was there in the room. So he was he was not the one to come and explain to me how the girl came and like give me just give me who asked you, my dear. It was not his job to, to, to come to me and tell me um see, see what happened. Pencil was supposed to be the one to come and explain to me how the girl was in his place and and why and you no know, tell me what happened. But he didn't say anything. I entered the I entered the room. He didn't say anything to me. Uh, no, it was not like oh oh you are here. Yes, and 
he never give me the usual hug, you know, at least hug me now. Wait a damn minute. He didn't even hug me. He was still sitting on the bed. And then he did he didn't introduce the girl to me. So I was not like, hi, babe, hi. I had to greet her because I just came inside and said that hi. He didn't even um, introduce the girl to me. So the friend was okay, the friend now took me outside and was not just telling me about how the girl came and everything that they knew from their secondary school, something, something, something. Yeah. So um that week we were I was meant to go for an event with Spencer to his um place because they were hosting an event at his house. So Spinach decided to follow us and go for the event. I'm like, okay, no wahala. Hmm? No wahala. Okay, then I was supposed to make my hair the same day and then we will live together, but then I couldn't finish like I didn't finish earlier in school. So I had to um make the hair that evening i still go for the event that evening because it, like the event was for for like two days so i asked them to to start going first since they couldn't wait like they were running out of patience so i told them to start going that i will meet them there then um fast forward to when i finished making my hair i was now i was already on my way to the to his house and then i got to school it was like I should not, I should not, I should not, I should not bother, I should not bother coming again. That um, there was no space for me to sleep. That's suspicious. Yeah, that's, fine. that's weird. I was inside the bus. I could not argue with him, so I just got the call. Like I was already angry, but I just, I just got the call. Then I had to divert to my brother's school. Then I met my brother. I went, I went to my, I went to see my brother. So yeah. Then the next day. Tell me why. Tell me why this Momo girl. Tell me why I still went to that place. You are ashamed of yourself. Are you not embarrassed? This is really embarrassing. I should have gone back. I should have gone. I should have gingerly gone back to my school. Hmm? But I had to. I had to start going there again for the event. When I got there. See, eh? I don't, I don't want to go into too, too much details in this. I just want to tell you guys what, what, like, what was the gist, like, the main thing that happened. So let, okay, let me fast forward to the evening. Eh? Um, I, Penso ha had already introduced um two of his friends to me at the event. Okay, so there were three guys and two girls. That was the two guys were me and Spinach, and then Penso, his friend, and and, and the new guy. So we were discussing. Then Penso left. Within five minutes, Pinach has disappeared too. Where did they go? Where did they go? <laughs> so I asked the friends, where is Penso? They don't know. I waited do ten minutes more. I asked them again, where is Pinach? They don't know. Then I left. I went to the room that I was supposed to sleep in. I went to that room. And then um I okay, I was like changing to my night to my night's way. So the friend came into the room and was like, Why am I acting like that? that do I like pencil? I'm like, Who like pencil? This is my boyfriend though. So like I, I don't get what you mean. I don't get what you mean. Well it's only like the boy was even shocked. The boy then told me that it's a lie that pencil said I was the sister and spinach was the girlfriend. <laughs> what? Hmm. So, so it's like so it was not like are you joking? Like are you playing with me? Play with you how now? I don't get meaning. So so it was not like Jesus Christ that he does not know that um that pencil has changed this much. So it was not like you go and call um pencil from upstairs. All along, he knew where pencil and spinach were, but he didn't want to say anything. So he now went to bring the boy to call the boy. I told him, I, I don't want to just leave him. I don't want issues. So he was not like, no, he's going to call him. He's going to call him. And I called um pencil downstairs. Pencil took took 
hours to come downstairs. It took bare hours to come downstairs. Okay. Where is spinach? Spinach was still up there in the in the balcony where, where they were. Yeah. She was still there. She didn't come downstairs with, with them. So um the friend came and dragged me to to the downstairs balcony. Like the balcony that was downstairs. Okay, let me say the porch. And took me there. So now sat me down. Like it, I was not facing pencil. It was not like an an, an interview. So I was not looking at him. He was looking at me. I was looking at Talk to me. Tell me. Talk to, excuse me. Talk to me. I'm hey, Jesus. So he didn't say anything. Like I, I I felt like he didn't know what to say or he was just trying to formulate the line in his head. So I got up. I was about to leave because he didn't want to say anything now. So so so, so he now held me back. I was like, don't you want to hear what I want to say? Let him speak up now. If you want to talk, you talk, man. Do you know what this boy said? Ah! <laughs> Whenever I remember this this line, eh, I just go bonkers. I just go mad. This boy told me, eh, it was a prank. I just wanted to know it, if he really loves me. Hey! Emotional damn it! My head was doing me to the internet. I was like, what? I was, uh, I was up on yesterday, my dear. Ah, Jesus. <laughs> Whenever I say remember this, I just go bonkers. Excuse me, what do you mean? What do you mean, my dear? Hey, <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> If you know me, if you know me very well, you know that I don't used to cry. Like, I'm, I am not a crier. I'm a hard guy, man. I don't used to cry. Even if, even when people say, say nasty things about me, I, I don't used to cry. The worst, the worst thing I hate in my life is someone accusing me of of, of, of what I do. I, do, I do not even do, but I will never even cry. But then this boy now came to lie to me in my face. You're telling me that you are playing a prank on me with it. Mm. I'm just speechless. Mm. So, like, I, I, I don't even know how I started crying. Like, I was shaking. I was vibrating. Like, you know, you know, when your anger has passed hundred degrees Celsius, like it has passed hundred degrees Celsius, I was boiling. Mm? Like, it felt as if my the bones in my hand and my joints felt like jelly. I was about to even collapse there. Like, why are you lying so much, my dear? Why are you? <laughs> what I already know what's going on. Why are you boys? Eh, I, I, I don't, I don't get boys. I don't understand boys. Like, why are you doing like that? Why are you doing like this, my brother? <laughs> hey, God, Jesus! <laughs> like, I, I swear, I cried. Mm. But it will never happen again. It's not gonna work. It's not gonna work. Only what? It's not gonna work. Excuse me. It's not gonna work. Nah. So that was how our love ended. Our relationship ended because they said one plus one is equal to two. I don't know how we're on three. Is it one, one plus one is not three now. Eh? Why are we three in this thing? So a, a babe has to move. I have to vamuse. Let me disappear. Jajali. Mm? I do not come, come here to come between you and the player with you people. Now, nah, I'm not all for that. So that was how that relationship ended because I had to disappear. Why yetly? Why yetly? Yeah. So that was how they took me from being the main chick to the side chick. I became the side thing because I was I, I was just the sister. I was just the sister. Yeah. So um, you lot know it's not gonna work again. It's not gonna happen again. It's not gonna work. I saw a um, guy's video was LDN, so I decided to make my own story and tell you guys my own story about it too. So with that being said, um, I'm just close out this video right here. I don't want to talk about this anymore. Yeah. Maybe in my next video, in my next video, I'll tell you guys about all my crazy boy stories. Not relationship shall, but let me say, even crushes and everything from when I was little. Yeah. So maybe in the next video, I'll tell you guys all about that. But with that being said, don't forget to like this video. Comment down below what you think. Subscribe. 
if you don't want to, if you don't know what to comment comment my name comment your name comment anything that you want to comment my dear and with that being said share to your family and your friends and i will see you guys in my very next video see ya catch ya later I should fuck up with